Hello guys, welcome to you. In this video, we are going to see how to install Android in VirtualBox. It is a very easy and simple process to install Android in a VirtualBox in any operating system. Example as Windows, Mac, Linux, it's work on the all operating system and it is a very easy and simple process. Before go to the, our video, if you not subscribe the channel, then subscribe the channel and also click on the bell icon so let's go to our video first we install the virtual box go to the any web browser that you like and here type oracle virtual box open the first link oracle virtual box here we find download click on this download or click on this download click on the download here we find many op many options go to the here here we find windows hosting i am using windows so go to the windows if you're using mac or Linux or any other version then go to the that's that operating system I am going to the Windows I click on the Windows and our download is started at the top here we find our download is started and it's take few seconds to complete download after download is complete we go to the installation part our download is completed now click on show in folder drag this file to desktop close it here we find installation double click on it click on the yes Click on the next, accept, terms and conditions, click on the next, next, yes, 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 install it. It takes few seconds or few minutes depending on the speed of your PC. So be a patient and wait for one minute. Installation is complete, finish it. Next step is download the Android ISO image that is also simple. Go to the any web browser once again. Here go to the here and search type Android x86.org and hit enter key first link is from the android x86 86 org open that link here we find download click on this download button here we find main download and the mirror go to the main download or mirror i go to the main download here we find the other versions i am going with the latest version here we find latest version click on this latest version Wait for a few seconds or download is started in a few seconds. Wait for a few seconds to download to, uh, to download to download to start. Our download is started now. Click at here. Here we find our download is started and it's like three or five minutes. So be a patient and wait for three or five minutes. Our download is completed now. Click on show in folder. Click on show in folder. Minimize it. Track this setup file to ISO file to desktop. Close it. Next step is go to the virtual box. Go to the start. Type virtual box. Click on the Oracle virtual box. Oracle virtual box is open. Here we find many options. Go to the here new. Create a new operating system or OS. Click at here new. Here we find many options. Give any name that you like. I give Android. You can give any name that you like. And here we find the folder. You can give any kind of the folder that you want. I go with the default folder location. ISO image, don't give ISO image at this point. Here we find type, go to the type, and here go to the other OS or Linux. I go to the other, in other select unknown or other 64 bit. Click at here. Here we find many options. Go to the hard disk, hard disk. In hard disk, give 20 GB or higher. I give the 20 GB or 10 GB is sufficient. Also, click on the finish. Next part is the setting part. Select the our operating system and go to the settings. In a settings, go to the first system, go to the system. In a system, here we find basics memory. Give the basic memory 2 GB or higher. Give 2 GB or higher. I give the 8 GB. You can give 2 GB or higher. Go to the processor. In a processor, give one CPU or two. I go with the two. In acceleration, go with the default or KVM. Go with the default or KVM. Next is the display. Click on the display. In a display, give entire video memory. Give entire video memory. Select your slider to the high point. After that, here we find storage. Go to the storage. Here is the our hard drive, and here is the our empty CD or DVD. Select that. To get here, choose a disk file. Go to the desktop. Here we find ISO image. Double click on it. Click on OK. ISO image is selected. Click on the OK. Setting part is done. Now start the our operating system or Android system. To get here. Now our Android system is starting by the back arrow key. Back arrow key, go to the advanced options, 
select the advanced option click on the advanced option in advanced option I'll also use the back arrow key and here we find auto installation auto installation to specific hardware hard disk here we find two options yes we want to install by arrow key select s yes, and click on the enter key installation is started and it takes few seconds and run android x86 okay and if you find this kind of error then i also iq the solution but in my case there is no error but if you have error then go to the settings and change the one option i show that option also for you go to the virtual box in a virtual box select your operating system in this case android go to the settings in a settings go to the storage first option is go to the storage in a storage remove the our cd or dvd or iso image select that click at here in cd or cd or dvd and click on to remove ticks from virtual drive it is removed now and if you if your mouse is not working in your android or the operating system or the virtual operating system then go to your system and here we find ps2 mouse then click at here and click on usb tablet and one another option if your operating system or the android os is not starting it's stuck on the blue screen or the black screen then go to here graphics control and change it to the vbox vga or vbox vga is not working then try these two things in my case first option is work 100% so i click on okay now i start the my os select this and click on the start I select the first option. I enter on the first option. Here we find many options. Click at here, and here we find English United States. You can see select any that you want. I go with the English United States. I cancel it and click on the start. It's searching for the Wi-Fi. Our Wi-Fi is connected by the our uh, Ethernet, and it's automatically detect when we restart the our Android. So I click on the skip. Okay, continue. Click on the next. Accept the terms and condition. I click on the not now. Skip anyway. Our Android is started. I want to quick set setup, so I go to the quick step. Quick step, sorry. And click on always or just one. I go to the always. And here we find our Android is started. You can choose this Android OS for the apps, but not for the games. If you use for the WhatsApp and other apps, then it's hundred and ten percent for. But if you're using for the games, then this Android OS is not for you. And if you want to start your uh, Wi-Fi, then restart or the turn off your Android device one or two time. And after that, our Wi-Fi is connected automatically, and it gets net from that Wi-Fi automatically. And you can accept some terms and condition after that. And after that, your Android OS is started normally. So, guys, this is the simplest way. to start or install android os in a windows operating system any windows operating system by the super simplest way so guys thank you for watching this video don't forget to like share comment on this video and don't forget to subscribe the channel thank you guys